Okay, uh, it's great to get back on the field. I have the season uh, right around the corner. Uh, you know, the first three days have gone very well. Uh, I got a great attitude, uh, very good mentality with this team as far as their work ethic, their focus, their concentration. Uh, about what you'd expect through three days. You know, our guys that have played a lot of football for us are doing very well. Robert Johnson, uh, Sly, uh, Koamisi on defense, Kepa Geisen, Kanape. So the usual guys are, are performing very well. Uh, same on offense. Uh, Matt Asiata, David Reed, Jeremy Brooks, Zane Beatles. So, so uh, not a lot to go on so far with the new guys. You know, we've only been in pads for one day. And so, uh, you know, we'll have to uh, really have a – We'll get a chance to assess the incoming recruiting class in the next uh, couple weeks and, and find out what they're all about. But, but to this point, it's been very good. Um, you know, we've got 105 guys in camp. We're right at the limit. Uh, we're excited about uh, you know getting underway in 20 some odd days and a lot of work to do between now and the uh, opener versus Utah State. But, but uh, really like the attitude, the mentality, and, and what's transpired so far. A lot, and like you mentioned, particularly at the start of the season, uh, you know, when you're breaking in a new quarterback. The two things you want to have uh, working for you are a, a very good defense and a strong run game. And, uh, you know, we need to have both those in place. Uh, you know, early indications are that we will be good on defense again, you know, if, if we continue to work hard and, and uh, you know, continue to develop. But, uh, yeah, that uh, will take a lot of pressure off of a, a new quarterback to, uh, you know, to be able to have those two things going for us. All three quarterbacks will get equal reps with the ones up until uh, after the scrimmage uh, this coming Thursday. You know, and what's that? Set five days from now, we'll have. Uh, you know, we're off tomorrow on Sunday. We got a uh, half padded practice on Monday, full pads Tuesday, uh, a double day on Wednesday, and then we go ahead and have a big scrimmage Thursday, and that'll really be the a defining moment in the quarterback battle to at least get it down to two. You know, that's the the objective there. If we get it down to one at that time, great. I don't think that'll happen. But uh, we got to get it down to two because we got to start sinking more reps into two guys. The reps are being spread too thin, and we don't want to do that for very much longer. It's good. Yeah, I think it's the first time that's ever happened, um, and uh, you know it shows to the or it speaks to the respect that the Mountain West uh, gained last year. I think that's carried over into this year, and uh, you know we're we're uh, you know happy to be ranked where we are. We don't put a lot of stock in it, but it's it's a, a sign that uh, you know at least people on the outside. I think uh, you know. Think we're doing some good things here, and and so uh, you know it's all good. But uh, you know, really, where you are in four or five weeks is is much more important than obviously where you are at the end is what's ultimately important. Not much change. You know, I'm uh, you know just picking my spots. Uh, you know, roaming around and and uh, you know trying to to uh, make as much evaluation as I can. And and uh, you know, we got two guys that were pro promoted from within, so there's a lot of continuity. There really is no uh, dramatic changes. You know, practice structure, everything is very similar to what we've been doing. And so, uh, you know, it's more just keep things going, you know, the, the way we have had them going rather than uh, wholesale change.